Well, a good Tuesday evening to you, True Believers. We jumpstart our week with some signing day happenings as Quincy High School Volleyball exports Madison Cramsey off to the hill at Culver Stockton today. Definitely, I've been playing for so many years, I can't remember how long, but it's definitely been a very hard and fun jersey journey, and I'm just so excited for the next step. It's just my happy place. It's where I feel the happiest, where the most at home with all my teammates and my coaches, and playing the sport that I love and I'm excited to carry that feeling over to Culver. Both of my parents went there and they teach there so it's just kind of been a part of my life for forever. I love watching the Culver volleyball team playing games like every season. It's it's just the place where I feel like I need to be. Oh for sure and just having her here for the first few years of the program like having her help build that culture that we're always trying to instill in players of that family and that love um, that she always showed to her teammates and to everybody. Um, it was just really great to see her get to do that at a different level as well. I definitely want to go into psychology. I definitely want to be a therapist. Mental health is a big thing in my life and I want to help other people with theirs. And on Monday, Missouri Baptist dipped into the rich Monroe City softball talent pool to secure a gifted infielder who hit 377 this fall, stole 24 bases, scored 28 runs, and drove in 21 RBI. It was a really small school, which I really liked, and I saw a bunch of people that I knew whenever I did go on like my tour, so I really liked that about school. Well, I just think it's a really good opportunity for me because I have put in so much work in the past and I'm just really excited. I don't know where I'm going to play because my travel ball coach actually is my coach at MOBAP and he plays me anywhere so I'm ready for anything. Oh, I mean, you know, like I said when she got here, you know, I didn't know anything about her. She came when she was a sophomore and, and she proved to me in her sophomore year that she deserved to be on that field and, you know, she's just a good asset all around because she works hard, she plays hard, she loves the game. You can tell she's one of those kids that just has fun doing it. But you know, she's worked hard in the off season too. I came and watched her do her speed and agility and watching her just get faster over the winter into the season was just awesome to see because she's very good, but you know, she got better, you know, and working and, and I think that she's gonna do that at the next level. She's gonna go walk in there and prove that she needs to be on that field. I think I wanna do something in business finance and I'm not really sure what I wanna do yet.